did we like it? Guess you have to tune in and wait to the end and find out, or unless we say it within the middle. Hey, everybody, what is good? This is your guy, Taz, with Taz and Philly. Came here to give you what you come here for, reactions. So this is a special um, reaction due to a PayPal donation request. So we thank you all so much for doing that. A lot of it goes back into the channel so we can um, pay for some behind the scene bills and also to maybe uh, pay for the software or the equipment. Um, so thank you. So um, your money goes towards a good cause. So we appreciate you very, very much. Um, this is a reaction to Boyce Avenue. We've reacted to them a few times now. So learning more and more about them. It was funny because the initial time I've, heard, I've reacted to them, it was one guy on screen. So I thought that must be Boyce Avenue. And I was like, what a cool ass name to be called Boyce Avenue. I didn't know. Um, and then come to find out through you fantastics in the comments that it's three and they're brothers and they all represent Boyce Avenue. So that's just really, really funny. But um, but I, I, I took light in it because uh, we don't like to do a whole bunch of massive research before we react to a someone for the first time because it's more fun to be educated from you because that's our conversation piece we can't see you unfortunately so this is our ebb and flow you educating us so that's why for some of you sprinkles of people that say how come you didn't know this to start with because that was intentional um so we we we're guided by you basically and it's better that way for us so in any event this is called fix you i know it's a cover so I did look that part up. So it's a cover of Coldplay. I've heard many songs from Coldplay. I don't know yet if I know heard this before. Once it starts playing, I'll know. But nonetheless, I never heard it performed by Boyce Avenue. So that in itself is going to be new for me. So uh, we represent music appreciation. Please, please, please make sure that you support these artists. We always emphasize that. Imagine if it was you. Um, as you see here, we've already subscribed to Boyce Avenue. But this song, no, we haven't liked it because we haven't heard it yet. So I'm hitting like free and painless. If you can't afford like to buy their music, um, then please do something free, a gesture like this to support them. Support them first, support us second. So please subscribe to us and like and comment to us and get those notifications smashed. Please, thank you. So without further ado, oh, I almost forgot. So this PayPal donation request goes out to Guido C. So Guido C., Thank you very, very much. You're fairly new to the channel. You already jumped in with both hands and feet. We're happy and humbled that you like something about our channel. So thank you so much. It really means a lot. Uh, now, without further ado, here we go. When you try your best but you don't succeed Okay, I heard it When you get what you want but not what you need When you feel so tired but you can't sleep Stuck in reverse And the tears come streaming down your face When you lose something you can't replace When you love someone but it goes to waste Could it be If 
Man, oh man, the beauty of song, the beauty of music. You don't know what music will do to you until you hear it. So I did not expect, once I started hearing it at the beginning, I was like, okay, I've heard this song before. It's been a while, but I never heard it from Boyce Avenue. But I also forget how like the song makes you feel. So, and hearing it, it's like you, I literally got like a chill up my back. And then a little water started falling out of my face. I didn't expect this. I didn't plan this. It doesn't happen all the time. I'm not the type of person that just tears up on every song that's played. Even if it's an emotional one, it's just certain ones can resonate more with certain people. So this song means a lot to me because it's all about being there for someone who's been through some struggles and stuff like that. And you want to try to fix them, um, help them, be there for them. And I, not like, I'm not at all like patting myself on the shoulder or anything like that because it's not like I look forward to fixing people or helping people. But if shit happens and they're in distress, I just tend, if you know, if I care about them, then I tend to just go that extra mile, like without even thinking about it, really. Like, it's like, I'm there for you. So one of my best friends who will remain nameless has been through years of shit and I've always felt compelled to be there for them and let them know that you you at least have one person in your corner. And I think if people who are in distress know that they have at least one, then that can move mountains. So luckily that best friend has did a 180, has been through this shit, been through the quicksand, been through all that 
and is now on the other side in a good way and is now making something of themselves. And I'm so, so ridiculously proud of them. Um, if they see this reaction, they'll know who, who it is. Um, but I was a part of that. And it, I was humbled one time because they had told me on their own accord, they had said, thank you so much. You've been there for me. And you really, really have always been there for me when sometimes nobody else was. And that just meant a lot because that was organic. I don't come out and ask people, hey, you know, I've been there for you, right? So when they say that on their own accord, like it really resonated. It meant a lot. Um, and But overall, I'm just glad that they're on the other side happy and better and have value in their life and things of that nature. So this song just made me think of that. And that's why I got the feelings that I had a little. Let us know like in the comments if you can relate to this. Is there people that are that you have helped out in some way? Or have you been the one that was helped out? If you want to share your truth there, it's up to you. Um, but I like songs that are so relatable because it reaches the masses. Many, many people, because I know I can't be the only one. Many, many people this song has resonated with. And they felt they felt appreciated, but they also felt it felt I guess gratitude because you want the person that you're helping to get to be helped, even if it's not from you. Like if I when I try to help people out, if like let's say I don't succeed, but they get help somewhere else and they get better, that's great. I'm not looking for it to be me, but if it happens to be me, great. Um, because there might be situations where I need help, and I would hope that the people I've helped have been there for me. Actually, I take that back. Some of the people I have helped have been there for me through shit in my life or whatever. Um, and just like encouragement and things of that nature. So, you know, and I thank them. I'm very, very appreciative to people. I don't hold it back. So I'm getting in a tangent here. So um to Boyce Avenue. Wonderful, wonderful collaboration. Um, I don't know their names yet. So the main singer has a beautiful, beautiful voice. The three of them collectively were just incredible. I love the sounds that they make. They had the acoustic guitar going on. And people who watch me a lot know I love me a good acoustic guitar. It just teleports me to a happy place. So really, really like that. And it was nice to see them at that concert live to see like the, the vibe of the audience. They were really engaged. They also had asked the audience to sing along. So I like that ebb and flow, just like we asked you to communicate with us. So that was really, really awesome. So um, thank you, Guido. Um, maybe not thank you for the tears. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But no, thank you for the, requesting this song. And thank you for your donation. Um, I wish Boyce Avenue continuous success. I hope they get more notoriety because, I don't know, it seems like they're not getting a lot of views and, and 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 acknowledgments at least on this channel but i think outside the channel like they should be bigger than that i mean they might be somewhere else maybe i just don't look big on youtube but maybe they're big other places this song was back in 2012 that they did this live so if they're still going strong this 2024 i guess they are doing well um but you don't have to be well enough so just keep on keeping on Anyway, this is the part of our show. We always do our thumbs up pass if we like a song and thumbs down ass if we don't. I gave it away. So thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. Very, very good. So, um, yeah, I hope you all have a good day. And, and hey, if this song resonates with you or if you're going through some shit um, and you need some solace or you need someone to just give you a, some, a, a shoulder to lean on, don't be too humble all the time and say, oh, I don't need anybody. It's okay to have a good old slice of humble pie sometimes because um, we're all human. We bleed. We have feelings, and it's nothing wrong with that sometimes. So thank you. So this is Taz with Taz and Philly, and I want you all to take it easy and keep it breezy. <laughs>